Okay, hello, this is uh, another Smith's uh, track, and this is Nowhere Fast, and this is from uh, the album Meat is Murder, and uh, yeah, so this was a request, and uh, yeah, I thought to reach my uh, Smith's quota for this week, uh, we'll do this one uh, as well. So yeah, we're going to get into it, and uh, yeah, it's just like two minutes and something, so not too long, and uh, yeah, I got the lyrics over on uh, my laptop, so I know it's going to be said. But uh, yeah, that's about it. All right, let's just get in. I'd like to check my charges to the world. I am a man of means, of slender means. Each household of fires is like a new silence in my town. And if the day came when my boat's a natural in motion, I'd get such a shock I'd probably jump in the ocean. And the weather train goes by such a sad sound. It's such a sad thing. I'd like to drop my trousers to the queen. Every sensible child will know what this means. The poor and the needy are selfish and greedy on her turn. And if the day came when I felt a natural emotion, I'd get such a shock I'd probably jump in the ocean. And when a train goes by, it's such a sad sound. Okay, so that was that. Um, we'll just do that. Okay, so nowhere fast. Yeah, uh, quick little song there um, on Genius.com. Uh, so it says this is a uh, this shows the song shows uh, from Meat is Murder. Uh, Morrissey's funny side um, with lyrics like I'd like to drop my trousers to the Queen, which I thought that the song I think it just started off with that line, didn't it? Yeah. And that kind of made me chuckle, and uh, so yeah, it's just like the song started really quickly. It seemed like there's no like uh, instrumental or whatever. We're just going, and uh, yeah, so I like to drop my trousers to the world. It starts off with, and uh, I am a man of means, of slender means. Uh, each household appliance is like a new science in my town, and uh, so yeah, it's, uh, for an annotation on this one, it says uh, so f the world. I'd rather not swear today. And it says, this song is an expression with boredom in the world and the people around him. So, I guess the narrator, yeah, okay, so the narrator would like to do something extra, extraordinary to give the people something uh, that would be something worth talking about. So, yeah, I mean, it's not a not a new theme for a Smith song, I would say. Um, this all works in with what I've heard so far. Uh and hearing uh, Morrissey's funny side, uh, it's always a treat. Um, so yeah, going to uh, the refrain, uh, the first one. Uh, so it says, And if the day came when I felt a natural emotion, I'd get such a shock, I'd probably jump in the ocean. Which is another tra uh, line that I thought was pretty funny. Um, but uh, so this is the narrator speaks to someone who seems to be uh, just affected by his current state of living. So yeah, he's never felt like a real emotion which I mean 
it's kind of, it's a sad kind of thing, but I mean, it's true for a lot of people. And, uh, yeah, so I mean, it, another, again, it's just, uh, not, uh, unlike other Smiths, like, themes in song. And, uh, yeah, it's just, I, I just like that line a lot. I mean, there's all these lines in the song. I mean, well, not all of them, but I mean, I like a lot of the song. I like a lot of the lyrics in the song. And, uh, it's just funny. I don't know. Uh, in a sad kind of way, I guess. Depressing way. Um, so yeah, it says also with the chorus, uh, and when a train goes by, it's such a sad sound. It's such a sad thing. So it says the sound of a train likely gives him the thought of someone escaping to some far off exotic adventure away from the dull, monotonous lifestyle he has become a slave to. So yeah, basically the guy, the narrator wants to, is pretty much jealous of the person that's getting away, I guess. And, uh, so yeah, it says, um, the sound of progressive and elsewhere, a progress and elsewhere puts his occupationally, uh, threadbare existence into glaring apparency. A lot of big words here. Uh, for the humdrum of his working class, lifestyle, uh, runs to a much, to a much slower riff than that of a train. So this is, uh, this is symbolically represented by Johnny Marr's, uh, riff in between the second and third verse. And that it is a solo that solo that it clatters away like the wheels of a train over uh, the tracks, and that's what uh, the person who requ who requested this said uh, that there's a great guitar riff in this, which yeah I took note of, and uh, yeah it was just nice to see or to hear I guess uh, Johnny Marr going at it, and uh, yeah it's very symbolic I guess now that make that makes sense to me, and uh, yeah I saw uh, a quote here, uh, I don't really want to read it all. But Johnny Marr uh, said about, uh, talked about the song in September of 2013, and uh, so he said he was trying to draw on American music in a way that had been forgotten. So he went, he goes on to say whatever. Uh, so he said, I liked hearing my parents play Eddie Cochran, Elvis Presley, and uh, the Stones, and Bo Diddley. So he said I was also obsessed by the beat, uh, Nowhere Fast has that rockabilly rhythm and Shakespeare's sister was written entirely from that rhythm. Some idea of a messed up Johnny Cash on drugs. It sounds half like that. And that's what I got uh, with that beat. Uh, I don't know. I can't really explain. But like, I don't know, uh, like maybe halfway through the song or something. And uh, it did remind me of like Walk the Line, I think it is. Or just anyway, just reminiscent of a Johnny Cash song. And uh, it did, this definitely did have a rockabilly feel to it. Which is uh, something I like, uh, which makes me like coming back to the Smiths because it's always something like different. Like last time, well not last time, but in a reaction recently, I said it kind of reminded me of like Joy Division. So it's just, it's like yeah, they draw on a lot of different bands, I guess, and uh, and singers, and uh, even when they're not trying to, maybe. But that's just it's reminiscent of other artists that I like, which is always nice. So yeah, I guess that's about it. I mean, I like this song. Uh, Nice little funny tune, uh, Morrissey being half serious, whatever, and uh, yeah, it's just uh, another great little tune, and I'm glad I listened to it. So yeah, Nowhere Fast from the Smiths, uh, that's about it. Uh, thanks for watching, you can request anything you want down below, and uh, I might get to it at some point. Uh, thanks for all the likes and comments and uh, subscribes and all that stuff, and uh, yeah, it's all nice and well appreciated. And, uh, yeah, I guess that's about it. Um, I'll see you guys later. So, yeah, thanks again. I'll see you later.